Well, good evening, New Skin. I am honored to be here and actually really humbled to share what I feel is the opening of this evening. And for those of you that might I just be meeting for the first time, I'm from Northern California. And close to six years ago when I was introduced to this business, I had my own business in real estate. And I wasn't interested, so it only took 13 telephone calls in the course of two months, 12 very adamant no's, one hang up, one threat. <laughs> and I finally took a look at Newskin. And when I did, what I saw was everything that I had been looking for, yet not in the package that I expected it to come in. And the things that I was looking for was the ability to help other people, to do something that ultimately one day would have a global impact and change people's lives around the world. I knew that I didn't want to have a cap on what was possible for me to create income or potential or otherwise. And I knew that ultimately I wanted to be traveling around the world, living different places six months out of the year, and knowing that on my last day on this planet, that I'd help change the lives of people around the world. Where does that exist? Now, there's a little bit of background on that story, and that is that I had been in business for myself since I was 20, and when I got introduced to New Skin, I was 31 years old. And why I ventured out to go into business for myself was between the, eight, the years of 18 and 24, I lost six people that were very close to me. And those were both set to my grandparents and my great-grandparents. My grandmother died in my arms, my great-grandmother in the room. For her last two breaths, I was there to watch those. And between the years of 18 and 20, I worked for someone else at a law firm where I'd been for five years. And so I didn't have the ability to be there as much as I wanted to be. And when I started my own business as a day spa owner where I was a massage therapist and clinical esthetician, I had the freedom and flexibility with my schedule, yet as those next four people that were dear to me passed, I spent all the time so that I would have no regrets and suffered personally, financially because of that, because I wasn't there to get the job done. So I knew early on that owning my own life meant owning my own business, yet the businesses that I had in the past, previous to New Skin, gave me some of the freedom and the flexibility, yet not total freedom. And so what I'm here to talk to you about today is to invite you, if you're hearing this information for the first time, or if you're hearing it for hundreds and hundreds of times, that you find something new today that you can grasp that's going to reach your heart and propel you to whatever that next level is for you and invite you that that be with our new skin family. Now, as I was on the plane headed to Salt Lake City for our convention, I was reading Spirit Magazine, and in that magazine, I opened it up, and there was an article that said in Business Daily News, there was a poll that was done. And 48% of the people that live in the United States have the desire of being an entrepreneur and owning their own business. Why do you think that is? Money. Yep. Why that is is because of this slide. If you look at this slide, what you'll see on the left-hand side is that as people move through life in the most affluent and indebted, probably, country in the world, that 95% of them at 65 will either be dead, be broke, or be still working. And I don't know about you, however, imagine what it would be like if you could just make choices in your life that every day when you wake up, you don't have to think about money. For me, I think about what it would have been like when I was sitting there with my grandma in hospice in the house and not thinking about how many clients I was going to have to see to make up for the time that I was there being with her. Because time and what you want to do with it is really the things that are important. And we know, based on market statistics and this, these, this, these facts, that this is the reality for most people. And so I'm going to suggest that if you're in the audience, it's because you want to create a different reality for yourself. And so what are some of the things that you can do? If you look at the chart on the right-hand side, you can see that 1% of people are actually going to create wealth in their life. And wealth in this study is defined as $10 million net worth. Now, maybe that's not what you need, yet that is a definition of freedom. And there's different ways that people go about that. As you can see, some do it through stock, others are top business professionals in sales industries, athletes and entertainers, and yet the bulk of those people are going to be business owners, people like you and people like me. Now, why is this key 
We've established that 48% of the people that live here in the, in the Americas want to have their own business. And I think of business kind of like this. It's a difference between a hotel and a home. So think about the hotel that you stayed in if you were at the convention earlier this week, or when you travel, think of that hotel. It's temporary. I mean, it's, it's here today, it could be gone tomorrow, it's short term. What I'm gonna invite you to look at this business as is as a home, because there's lots of businesses that you can do, yet this home that's available in New Skin will give you things that no other business, not even in this industry, will give you, and we're gonna talk about some of those things. Now, 1099 income is really key, because if you want any kind of lifestyle, it's really nice to be able to have that lifestyle be a write-off. <laughs> so that as you're having fun and making the impact that you want to make and whatever those things are important for you, that that's part of your business and it's worked into that. So we're going to cover five key things. And why I love this is because this information is the same information in the same format that I heard six years ago when I was introduced to this business. And why you want to find comfort in that is because if you're brand new here today, you can feel confident that there's a system that you can plug into, that you can learn, and you can be groomed by that system. And whatever your dreams are, and whatever your goals are, and whatever you want to see possible in your life, it's learning and plugging into and mastering this system, and you can go wherever you want to go. So the five things that we're going to look at are really important. The first one is market trends. Why is it important to know what the market trends are, and what is the power in a trend? The second one is exclusivity around products and technologies, because there's a lot of great things competing in the market space that are marketed in all different ways, yet what's going to set you apart with what you have in your business? The third thing is the partnerships that you choose, because you will rise or fall based on who you align yourself with. And so we're going to talk about why those partnerships are key. The fifth thing is compensation. Is it going to be worth your time, your energy, your effort to go out and build this business? If you were in the five-plus session with Brent Bryson, who did an incredible job in sharing truthfully and honestly his story, yes, everyone give him a round of applause. It was not all pink elephants and clouds. <laughs> Right? Is it going to be worth your time, energy, and effort based on that compensation? More importantly, what's the context of what that compensation means for you? And the last point is timing, because not all timing is created equal. And windows of opportunity open and they close. And when they're open, take action, miracles and dreams can come true. And so as we jump into that, that first trend that we're looking at in the market is a trillion dollar trend. And a trend is simply where is the money flowing? Where are people spending money? So by a show of hands, who here tomorrow wants to look worse, feel worse, and be uglier? <laughs> Nobody. Okay. Well, I would suggest that a lot of the people that you know in your lives feel the same way. They want to look and feel their best for as long as possible. They are already today spending money to do that, and they will continue to spend money to do that. That global trend is called the anti-aging trend. Now, included in that is people that have, in the Americas, 70% or more an issue with weight management that will ultimately impact the quality of their life, their health, and their lifestyle. And so what New Skin has done is created solutions to that demand in the marketplace that are different from any other ones out there. If you remember, I said in the beginning that part of my background was as a clinical esthetician, and so I knew products inside and out. And when my ex-husband called me to look at New Skin, he was a construction worker. And not that, you know, he didn't know anything about skincare. He just didn't know anything about skincare. So when he's calling me about anti-aging, I'm thinking to him, I don't want to use just any products that are on the market. I want to use the best products that are in the market. Because first and foremost, I'm a consumer. And I want the best results possible. And I will pay for those results. And being a little bit arrogant at the time, from my point of reference, and all of the education I had about products and science and technology, and what had to go into those to make them work and actually create results, and knowing that they were just packaged under different labels, essentially the same thing, it's, and then thinking that anyone could get them from a distributor with new skin, I was like, this just really doesn't make sense. Yet when I took a look at those products, I'll never forget my first team at university, I toured the labs, I'm getting this feeling like, you know what, this is pretty exciting. This looks real, it looks legitimate, the scientists are, you know, everything's lining up with what they say. I walk in the product store and I pick up the acne line. And I look at that product and I flip it over on the back. And, hmm, 
hmm, the percentage of a certain ingredient was half the percentage of what I could get in the treatment room for my previous career. And I remember that moment and tears welling up in my eyes because everything that I had seen that was possible with what this business could provide, I knew could only stand if the products were good. And so Patrick Baum, who's one of the people that helped bring me into the business, for the first time, because I was a little bit difficult to recruit, <laughs> he puffed up his shoulders, he's about 6'3", he stepped closer to me and he looked me in the eye and he said, do you think that a company that does a billion dollars a year in revenue is going to have products that are crap? <laughs> said, well, yeah, but what about this? And he said, if you could take two seconds and walk your little self over and talk to one of those scientists and ask that question, I'm sure that there's a very legitimate answer. So I took the time to do that, and in, in fact, there was. And the brilliance of it was, it wasn't just about that. It was with the other things that were in that product. It was even more effective than that product alone in a higher percentage. Ninety-nine percent of the people that you talk to, probably ninety-nine and a half percent of people, that's going to be completely irrelevant to, because all consumers care about is does the product work. Yet for somebody like me with the background that I had, I needed to know why and that if I was gonna stake my years of trust, credibility, and the reputation that I had in business to start something new, there could not be one hole, not even one little hole in what was there because if I could find it, someone else would as well, and ultimately that business would crumble and so would my reputation. So when you look at these products, New Skin creates products like no other in the market. On the inside, outside as well as on the inside. This wasn't as important to me because I felt fine when I got introduced to this business. And I remember the first time that I put my hand in front of that scanner, it was in the kitchen, sitting on the table, and you know, I was still in a resistant state, and so I was being explained what this biophotonic scanner is and that it's going to tell me how healthy I am inside and if what I'm eating and any vitamins that I'm taking are actually working. And I'm like, woo, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's probably some, you know, button that you push to give somebody a score so that you can rope them into getting on products. I mean, this is the conversation I'm having in my mind. And so when I initially put my hand in front of that scan, I got a scan score of 13,000 points, which is in the red on the far left, and then got an understanding of what that scan score was, that, oh, yeah, that's where people that are on chemotherapy scan, that's where, you know, I'm like, but I'm healthy. Now, that doesn't mean that that was an issue for me. It just meant that that's how well protected my body was to fight sickness and disease based on what I had inside of it at that moment. So now I want you to think about this in a business perspective, because the person sitting in my kitchen was my ex-husband <laughs> scanning me. So, of course, I'm going to be resistant to anything he wants to tell me. And the second thing is that there was something that kind of piqued my interest in that. And that was to do some more research and find out more, and here's why. The reason why is because four years before that, I'd had a brain tumor. And while I, while I felt fine that day standing in the kitchen, I'd known what it had been like to not be healthy. And so something in my mind said, what if? What if this is real? And what if these products actually work and can help me? Why I tell you that story is because if he had come to me talking to me about the science of these products, which God knows there's the science, there's clinicals, there's white papers, there's all kinds of information that you can get that stands up and has been validated by the medical community. If he had come to me with that, I would have looked at him and said, you dig in the dirt for a living. You're full of it. But he didn't say any of that hand that scanner, I got my own score and then I did my own research. Now on that product then, 13,000, 30 days later, I was at 28,000 and 30 days after that, I was at 39,000. And the skeptic says, well that could be coincidental, so I went off the product. And within 60 days my scan score was back down at 23,000 points. It is incredible what these products do, and my story is my story. I encourage you to get your own story of the products because they work. They are like no other products in the market. They change lives. 
What's really exciting is I don't have to worry about creating the next genius product because part of what New Skin's done is invest in innovation that has a pipeline full through the next five to 10 years. And this is an example of that investment right across the street. The ribbon was cut last week for the Innovation Center. Over $100 million cash spent as an investment. It houses the scientific labs that will continue to do further research and development to make sure that we have a robust product line that continues to be the best out there that changes lives. That's an investment that this company has made in you and me and anyone that you'll talk to. So we talk about partnerships, which is the third point. And partnerships are key. New Skin is brilliant because success leaves clues. Nobody that's ever been successful in the world, period, has done it alone. And I would challenge you to think of one person that has. I don't think you'll find one. And New Skin's brilliant from a business perspective because they have a commitment to be the leading direct sales company in the world by paying their distributors more than any other company out there. Yet in order to do that, there has to be partnerships that are gonna allow them to take them further than where they could take themselves alone. And so through the years, New Skin has invested and will continue to invest in partnerships that create that exclusivity, that create that edge in the market. So the acquisition of Pharmanex back in the late 90s, which is all of the nutraceuticals for the inside of health, that acquisition means that it came with a team of 75 PhD level scientists that continue to do that research and development. Dr. Chang, some of you saw this weekend. Wasn't he incredible? <laughs> Amazing. And as those acquisitions continued, they helped to position us. The acquisition of Knox Technologies as that galvanic spa launched with the gels back in 2008 now to address aging at the source for the first time in the skin and LifeGen Technologies that was just acquired at the end of 2011. Think about what that actually means. When you go into the store or talk to someone that sales with the, any company in the industry that's selling any kind of nutrition, how do you know it works? They don't have a way to measure it. Yet more importantly, based on what we now know because of all the research that's been done by LifeGen, that it's about addressing sources of aging where they are which is what happens in the genes. LifeGen, with that acquisition, is 30 years of research and development that New Skin owns and can now use to continue to test ingredients, to bring new products to the market that are exclusive, that are patented, that work like no others, that no one else has or no one else can even touch in the way that they perform. That's the importance of making acquisitions, and our partner recognizes that that's key and keeps cash on hand to be able to have at any moment in time that ability to position to just make our opportunity as distributors in the field that much stronger. I'm not a scientist. I like colors though. And as I look at these, uh, here's how I explain how age lock works. When you're young, everything's functioning at optimum levels. Your recovery rate's good. If you think about it, if you're five years old and you sprain your ankle versus if you're 70 years old and you sprain your ankle, your recovery time is going to be a lot faster when you're younger because your body is optimally renewing itself. Well, as we age, that continues to get slower and slower and slower and slower. And again, it happens when you're 25 and your body, it starts happening in your early 20s. That process is getting slower and slower and slower. And so what the AgeLock brand does is it communicates with whatever that product is targeting to reset it to function at optimum levels, at youthful levels, from the inside out, from the outside in. That is remarkable. Nobody in the industry can do that. Nobody in the world can do that because we have exclusivity around that science, technology, and the patents that go with it. Give New Skin a hand for that. So when I like the, look at pictures like this, my first question is, who's doctored them? And then, you know, I start digging and see oh, if there's pictures that are on corporate materials, they've had to go through legal. They have, there's this whole big process because we're publicly traded. These are corporate approved pictures, and it just means that the products work. Yet, there's something that's really kind of interesting about that. And... My first three years in the business, no one in my family used these products. I have a sister that's three years younger than me. 
She knew my background. She was buying stuff from other places, and she was having things injected and, you know, other things. <laughs> so what happened, though, was pretty interesting because for our entire lives, anywhere we went, people would always, you know, if we would one be meeting one of us and didn't know the other, they'd go, oh, well, you're obviously the older sister. And I'm, you know, I just took that to mean that's because my, that was my posture, not because of how I looked, <laughs> age-related, right? That, that was the story I made up anyway. And then what started happening is when we would meet people, people would start going, oh, well, you're the younger sister. My sister was spending hundreds of dollars a month having stuff done to or on her face. And yet she wasn't using our products. So at the end of a little over a year ago, it's coming up on, it'll be two years now, I get this phone call from her. And she's all freaked out, and she says, I'm, I'm really stressed out because I have, am I cutting out? Thanks. She says, I'm really stressed out because I have this date with this doctor for the first time, and I have this thing, like, right here on my face, and it's red, and it looks like a volcano, and I'm really self-conscious. And I took a deep breath, and I said, Erin, you have something under your sink that I gave you that I know you haven't used that will help that. She's like, I thought that was just for the cellulite on my thighs on my butt. No. And so I go over, I help her use the product, give her, she gets a galvanic face treatment. I leave because God knows I don't want to talk to her, you know, anything about why the product's working or what it's doing. And so I go home. My phone rings an hour later. It's my sister, and I'm like, this is the call I don't want to get. She's had some kind of bad experience, and I'm never going to hear the end of it after, you know, over two years and not using our products. And I pick up the phone, and I hear, I'm a believer. <laughs> like... My sister has had an ADR ship every month since that treatment since and is on over nine of our products now. Our products work. They get results like no other products, and she's actually saving money now over what she was doing before and getting better results. These are products you can feel confident taking to the market with your family and friends. Moving on to that segment of anti-aging about diets not working. Diets don't work because they're short-term. And they are addressing symptoms of the problem, not the source of the problem. And here's an, a depiction of what it looks like. If someone, let's say Joe in this instance, is 230 pounds, the red part of his body is what represents the muscle, which think of that as the engine or the fuel. The outside is the fat. It's the extra stuff that sits on top, and he wants to lose that. So he does what a lot of people do and does some crazy calorie-restricted thing or diet that's not sustainable long-term. And what happens is he loses the weight, yet close to 40% of what he loses is muscle. And now his body's ability at rest to be burning fat has dropped. And so he'll go on a diet again after this happens, and he shoots up to worse than he was before. I know this cycle because I've been on it. And I used the scale to gauge how healthy I was or how healthy I wasn't. And there was one point in my life where I looked really good on the scale and really not healthy. And then there was another point where I just didn't look good at all and looked really bad on the scale, still really not healthy, and never having a real solution to that problem. Well, New Skin has a solution like no other solution because it's not a diet. It's really about helping your body to go back and function at optimum levels as it relates to metabolism, as it relates to fat storage, so that you can be the healthiest long-term, not yo-yoing up and down. That product is called TR90, and we just got it last week. And not again now till April. So the demand for that product was huge, and it shows, think about market trends and people spending money, that product flowing to the market, $40 million sold out in just over two hours, two and a half hours here in North America. Give yourselves a hand for your participation. Now here's the interesting thing as we talk about health. I did the TR90 product before it was released on the market, I've been taking Life Pack Nano, T Green, Marine Omega, Extra Marine Omega, Rishi Max, Eye Formula, Vitality. I've been taking those products for years. And the highest I ever got my scan score was 53,000 points. Yet after 90 days on the TR90 system, 
not only did I go down 7% body fat, my scan score went from 53,000 to 68,000 points. The less body fat you have, the better your body can absorb nutrients and the healthier you're going to be from the inside out. Yet another benefit of being healthy and using our products. Now, when we talk and move into the business piece of this, upward growth is good in business. Would you agree? Yeah. yeah. So this compounded, compounded annual growth rate just shows that we are on a trajectory of going up that is continuing to get steeper and steeper as we go, which is really exciting when you think about corporate partnerships. How many of you are in a relationship, have been in a relationship, thought about marriage, are married, or have been married? <laughs> okay, good. The rest of you, I'm not sure what you're doing. <laughs> you're serial something, I don't know what we'd call it. If there was a point zero 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 one eight percent chance that that relationship was going to last long term, would you have given it a second thought? No. Quite possibly not if what you wanted was a marriage. In our industry of direct sales, that is the statistic for companies that will last 20 years or more, do a billion dollars or more in annual revenue, and create a place that you can call home, meaning that you can go, you can build, you can do the work once with a company and be done in a home. That's incredible. And what I love is a third-party validation. Because new skin could say all kinds of great stuff about itself, yet that's never as powerful as what other people say about new skin. If you saw a recent issue of Investor's Business Daily that came out within the last couple of weeks, you'll see that new skin is at the number one on the list for top stock pick. I remember sitting at the kickoff event in January of 2008 when the stock was $7 a share and hearing about the vision of where the company was going and thinking to myself, yeah, <laughs> that sounds good. I'm not gonna go out and buy the stock. And three months later, the stock was $18 a share. I bought the stock. And uh, this week, the stock over $113 a share. There are reasons why, and it's because of what New Skin's bringing to the market the success that's happening for the distributors, more importantly, the future of where New Skin's going as we create history. Now, how many of you were at the Force for Good Gala dinner that happened earlier this week in Salt Lake City? All right, Force for Good is a part of New Skin's philanthropic arm, dedicated and devoted to changing the lives of people around the world, specifically children. And that, that Force for Good Gala that just happened at our convention, there was $2.2 .2 million dollars donated to the Force for Good Foundation that night from New Skin Distributors. Give yourselves a hand for that. As a culture, whenever the, you can create abundance, New Skin's culture is there's a responsibility to do good and give back, even if you're not yet creating that abundance, because giving is what creates the abundance. And that is really the values that are here in that corporate partner. Now, the partner's been around 29 years, stood the test of time, is doing more than a billion dollars a year in the industry, and as a matter of fact, last year did two billion. This year, we're on track to do more than three billion dollars. And why that is so key, aside from the growth, is that we're publicly held. So you can go look online and see whatever you want to see about the company's financials. There's no hype, there's nothing that's elevated, and in this industry, a lot of things are built on hype and built on a story that's just not true. And with New Skin, the truth is good enough, so the stories that you hear are the truth, and I would encourage you to go validate them, because every time you'll find that they just get better, and your belief will go up as you see the truth in those stories. So there is no other leader in the industry like New Skin in direct sales, from the culture, the community, and the partnership that is there that is committed to your long-term success. So that if you're sitting here today and you're looking for a home or you're wondering if this is the home for you, it is. Because nothing else, nothing else out there compares. Now let's talk money. This slide, to some of you, may mean some things. To another of you, it may mean something different. I'm going to suggest that what this slide is about is leadership. 
and that the numbers that are associated with each level of advancement or progression are simply a reflection of your personal leadership. Now, that may be frightening to some of you and think, oh, my goodness, a leader. I'm not a leader. I don't want to be a leader. Well, you are. People are following you. It's just a question of where are you going? You will always have people follow you. Get clear on where you want to go so that the place that people follow you is a place worthy of going, meaning that it will change their life and help them get what it is that they want. As I look at these numbers, you know, they were numbers on a page when I first saw them. And that first one that I focused on was that Ruby position because there was a free trip associated with it. And never in my entire life had I had a free trip because I'd worked for myself or I worked for a law firm where trips were not part of the deal. So my goal was to get to that first position called Ruby and that comes right around $2,500 a month, not life changing, yet the free trip sounded good. And when I started this business, I had 80 grand in debt. I had no money coming in because the six deals that I had in escrow weren't closing and I needed money. So that looked like a good goal, get a free trip and get some money right now. That's what that meant to me at that point in time. What would it mean for you if you had an extra 2,500 to 3,000 every month that just showed up because of something that you'd gone out and done and built? Now, as you advance in that leadership to help other people and you help eight people that want to do a business for themselves, which we know one in essentially every two people that you're going to be in front of for the rest of your life want to be an entrepreneur and have their own business, you have a 50% chance of every person that you're in front of, they want to do a business. If you help eight people to do that, now you're looking at what for many is the American dream and a six-figure income. What does that mean for you? Can you imagine what that means? Well, here's what it meant to me. About six weeks ago, I was up on my way to Sacramento for an appointment, a business appointment, and um, from out of nowhere, I got hit by a car on the driver's side. And I didn't see it coming. And when I got hit, I opened my eyes to see glass shattering all over the top of me. And when I looked to the left, there was, a, there was a van right there. And I sat there shocked and stunned. And I sat there for about 10 minutes. And in those moments, what happened is I, the only things going through my mind were all the people that I loved and that I cared about. People that I wanted them to have whatever they wanted in their life. I wanted them to have the peace of mind of not having financial stress. I wanted them to have the best health that they could possibly have. I wanted to be part of all of the, the special moments that were yet to come for each one of those people. That's all I thought about as I sat in that car. And over the next few weeks at home, I was in bed, not realizing that I had a concussion. Um, and that's the reason I was sleeping 16 to 17 hours a day, exhausted, having a lot of anxiety about even having conversations with people. And, and pushing myself to do that anyway, yet in bed, laying there and thinking, I've built a business to diamond. And not one time as I was laying there did I think about money. And whether it was going to be two or three weeks or two or three months or two or three years, I would have had that same peace. So the numbers that are on this chart, they're real. They're on the New York Stock Exchange, yet they need to have personal meaning for you of what would it mean for you if you had that income every month. When I first looked at this business, I looked at the one on the end because, of course, that's a really big number. I didn't make that in real estate. There was no way that I was going to make that in real estate in what I could see and for what I was willing to do to create income. And when I learned that 95% of the people that have been with New Skin for 10 years are here, that really got to me. Because I knew at 31 years old, I was definitely going to do something for the next 10 years, and nothing that I had done or nothing that I was doing at that moment in time was going to create that. It didn't have the ability to create that, let alone create it every year if I took the year off to travel or do whatever. And that was the tipping point for me when I looked at this business. What is that tipping point for you? That tipping point where you go, There's, I, I can't not do this because of what this would mean for my life. And even more so, I can't not do this because the people that I care about most, I want to have that same thing as well, if they choose. It's not just numbers on the page. It's about your personal leadership. And I was told when I started this business, it's the easiest thing to do is commit once. 
Because if you wake up every day and question your commitment and have to do that over and over again, it's going to be a really long road. Now, committing to building a business and making New Skin your home is something that's going to take you on a journey that quite possibly will be the hardest thing that you've ever done. Not because it's complicated, because there's a system that's in place. The system that exists with System 7 means that anybody, regardless of your background or your levels of success or your education or where you come from in the world, anybody can be successful in this business because there's a system to plug into for your success. Whether you do or whether you don't will be up to you, and that is why anyone can be successful because of that system. So as you look at these numbers, think about really what would the impact be? What are the prices that you're willing to pay for whatever those things are for you? And be open and willing to hearing and receiving and looking for what it is that you need to find in, over the next two days in the stories that you're going to hear. What are those things that you would need to find, that you would need to hear for you to commit and this to be your home, that you go out and change your life and the lives of other people as well? Now, as we move to that compensation, the company's done $9 billion in commissions paid out. And this year, we will break a record for our first time ever of paying out a billion dollars or more in commissions out into the field. People like you and me. Incredible. Here's what's really interesting, and there's a funny story that will go with this. Yet, New Skin, back in 2006... Uh, or excuse me, 2010, every six days, had one new person that earned their first million dollars in career earnings. And then that dropped down to one new person every five days in 2011. And now it's one new person every four days. What other company do you know of in the industry, out of the industry, that creates one new person every four days that exceeds a million dollars in career earnings? I don't know of anyone. There's not one out there. Yet here it happens at New Skin. And that with new skin creating history is going to go to three days, to two days, to every day. What do you want your day to be? Pick your day. Get clear on that right now. As I sat at the convention this weekend and I walked out after the recognition night, of literally thousands of people that had advanced through leadership and were being recognized. I made sure that I sat in my seat and watched every single one of them walk across the stage because it was a reprogramming at an even deeper level of the paradigm that I had. If thousands, literally over 3,000 people can walk across stage for advancement in leadership and the financial compensation that goes with that, anybody can do this business. The future and timing. Timing of where we're at today is historic. We have made history. The launch of TR90 into the market is the single largest product launch that has ever happened in the industry of network marketing. Over 500 million, close to $600 million in product that went out globally within the last month. In January of 2008, which was my first kickoff event in LA, I remember having a conversation with uh, team lead Charlie Patterson, who is one of the incredible leaders and mentors for me in this business and has been a huge part of putting this entire Success Summit event together. Everyone give Charlie a round of applause because this is no small undertaking. Charlie was one of the closing speakers at that event and when he came off of the stage, uh, you know, I didn't know him. I didn't have any kind of relationship from working with him. And he said to me, what are your goals with this company? I said, well, my goal is to go to the top. And he said, well, you picked a really good time. And I said, why is that? And he said, because Newskin's going to do a billion dollars this year and we'll be doing $5 billion a year. And in my mind, I stopped and I, th and I thought, that is the most arrogant thing I have ever heard. <laughs> Have you not noticed what's going on in the economy? I'm in real estate. It's on a decline, and you're telling me this company is going to go up. And that was January of 2008. Here's what happened. G uh, 2008, $1.1 billion in revenue. 2009, $1.33 billion in revenue. 2010, $1.54 billion in revenue. 2011, $1.78 billion in revenue. 
2012, 2.17 billion in revenue. This year, 2013, we will exceed 3 billion in revenue. So I can stand here with confidence and say that the message that I heard from corporate that we will be doing $5 billion a year by 2015 and we will be doing $10 billion a year by 2020 absolutely will happen. So there's one question. Is it going to happen because you participate or is it going to happen because it's going to happen anyway without you? As we move to how you can be part of creating history with this company, it's about getting really clear on that picture that you see for yourself. I would invite you to make this your home. Make whatever sacrifices there are that you would need to make to capitalize on that growth as we go from $3 billion to $10 billion and set yourself free and the people that you care most about. In the process of that, you're going to get healthier. You're going to look and feel your best that you ever have in your life before now because you're a product of our products. And these are the different packages that are available. So as someone wants to take that step and get started, everyone starts the same way. The, the packages are wholesale packages. Pick products that you want to create a story around. You purchase three of them. You get one free. Those stories are important. You heard my product stories today. If I had not become a product of the product, I would not have those stories. I would not have this conviction. And I would not have seen the success as fast as I did when I first started in this business. This is part of the system that's in place for you to be successful. And again, all you have to do is surrender to that it's worked for thousands and thousands and thousands of people before you. It will work for you too. There's a reason for everything and that this is what's available for you to step into and follow the lead and follow the guide of the person that's introduced you to what I believe is the greatest gift that you could ever receive in your life. Thank you.